Hey guys, welcome back to Eric Reactions. I'm going to be watching the trailer for Life is Strange 2. It just dropped right now, and I'm really excited to watch it. Uh, I've played all the games prior. I played Life is Strange before the storm, and Captain Spirit is actually on my channel, so check that out if you haven't already. And uh, I want to find out who we play as and what the story is, so let's get into it. What are we going to do now? There's nothing we can't do. Who's the one with the powers? I have no idea where we are. Feels like we're walking nowhere. Did they run away from home? I don't think Daniel understands what's going on. I can't tell him the truth now. I just can't. How am I supposed to take care of us out here? Why does he have to take care of him out here? Oh, I like those drawings. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> On the ground! Don't move! Oh, oh, Jesus. What are we gonna do now? There's nothing we can't do. Whoa. As long as we're together. I think you can kind of hear police sirens in the background. Or that's the way they made the music sound. Wow, guys. Um, it's intense. It's definitely a different st story of uh, from uh the first life is strange and from before the storm those were like kind of slice of life and then with a, additional powers but this one seems much more fantastical so it seems like a much different situation seems like he may have killed a couple of cops um i'm not sure if it's the brother actually it would probably make sense if the older brother had killed the cops he probably would have run off on by himself but it might have been the younger brother who did something and that's why he's took off with him, like, took him with him, and he's hiding with him. Uh, I'm a, there's a lot of speculation here, but yeah, I'm glad to find out who the characters are, and this probably means that Chris in uh, Captain Spirit has no powers, and the one who saved him was the younger brother. If my theory is correct that the older brother took him away because the younger brother attacked the cops by accident. Um... Wow, this is really interesting. I'm going to mute it and drag back a little bit. I wonder how hard they're going to press on this um, cop issue because, as you all know, police brutality is horrible in our country right now. Um, but this game is being made not by Americans. I forget if they're French or there's some sort of developers that aren't from America, uh, from the United States, rather. And it'll be interesting how they how this this will work and how they'll attack this issue and yeah i think somebody let me see if it's possible to know no he definitely punches he definitely punches a cop right yeah he definitely punches a cop and then the kid is unconscious i, I forget their names but the younger boy is unconscious um Maybe the younger kid, the younger brother, uses his powers by accident and he uh, becomes unconscious because of it. And then the cops are about to take him in and the brother like hits him and takes his brother and runs. That's my best guess at the moment. Uh, but it seems like we're going to be in nature a lot more since we're running on the run. And I can't imagine... I don't know, the story just could go so many ways. And uh, it seems like... The brother's power is some sort of kinetic energy where he can push and push things away from him. Or, I don't know, he can just use his mind to move things. Which, I mean, Captain Spirit wanted to do in his uh, imagination, but... Yeah, the quality in this trailer isn't the best, but it looks like there is going to be some beautiful scenery. And uh, I love this. Lila's best face. I love the drawings here. It's... I'm... I hope this means that we're getting another journal type thing where uh, you go into the menu and you can see a whole bunch of uh, pictures or photos or like uh, 
summary like bios of characters written from the point of view of whoever's journal it is that's i feel like that is pretty much staple in life is strange um yeah because in max's journal uh during her dream sequences things would change uh during chloe's as well so i don't remember i don't think there was a journal feature in captain spirit i don't yeah there was just a to-do list which was cute as well but i'm looking for a more, more full-fledged thing and uh yeah, this game looks... I'm, I'm really excited. I'm definitely going to play it on my channel, so please subscribe if you want to check that out. And, uh, yeah, this is... I'm very excited to play this. I'm going to, day one, play it right away, and, yeah, hopefully it'll... I know a lot of people are afraid that, that nothing can live up to the first Life is Strange, and I'm a little worried about that, too, but I also trust the developers. Uh, I didn't like Before the Storm as much as... Life is Strange season one, because I, I don't know. It just felt like the first, the first, uh, the first episode was really, really good, and then I kind of, it kind of went downhill from there. But I still really enjoyed it, and yeah, I'm excited how everything ties in together. Because they also they said that every one of these stories is in the same universe, so maybe we'll see if Chloe and Max are still alive. I mean, I mean, Max is still alive. I don't know if. Well, we don't know if Chloe's alive, because we don't know what choice is canon. Like, yeah, if... Spoilers for Life is Strange, I don't know why you're watching this if you haven't played it already, but spoilers for Life is Strange, go away if you haven't <laughs> played it already. Um, yeah, we don't know if the Bay or Bay ending is, as in B-A-Y and B-A-E. We don't know which ending is canon, if uh, destroying Arcadia Bay is canon, or if killing Chloe is canon. So... Yeah, I'm excited to find out. Maybe we'll get an Easter egg here or there, finding out about what happened to them. And I'm really interested to see what the relationship is like between these two brothers and what lengths they'll go through go through to, for each other. And I'm also interested in knowing what power, what the extent of the powers are. And uh, yeah, there's a lot to there's a lot of speculation to do. I'm gonna try and keep away from it though. No more looking at theories. I want to go into it without thinking too much and just explore the game. Um, fresh. So anyway guys, uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon for the next video. Bye friends!